That's right. We're on live. We're going to get this thing done one way or another. What's up to y'all? Today I want to show you guys how Goosey here guides me in the snow. So here in the lovely Northeast, we've gotten a couple more inches lately. Um, and usually when I walk around when it's snowing, it's really hard for me to tell like what the difference is between the sidewalk and where people have shoveled, where people's footsteps are, and like the rest of the snow. So she could do a much better job at that than I can, or a cane can usually. Um, I put on her gentle leader. Yes, hi. And that is not a muzzle. It's called a gentle leader. Yes, shake, shake, shake. She's so happy. She's like, let's go, mom. And that's just a training tool. Um, basically, it helps her kind of like, I don't know, it reminds me of like reins on a horse. <laughs> it, it like helps me keep control of her, especially when it might be a little bit slushy or slippery. Um, she's a really young dog. She's really excited. So it helps me keep track of her. Gretchen, forward. So we're on our way. Good girl. All right, there you go, Goose. There you go. Up, up. Up, up. Yay, good job. And I will say it is a lot harder walking around. Like over here, it's shoveled really well, actually. They must have like snow plowed it or something. But it's really inconsistent. Like, is it going to be slushy? Is it going to be mostly uncovered? Is it going to be super well covered and salted or no? That's the challenge of it. Okay, so now we've come to a curb. Curbs are another really big challenge for us um, when it snows. This is a really mini street, um, but it's hard when it's, I mean, this curb's pretty good, but usually it's covered more in snow and that's hard for her and for me to distinguish. But it's all quiet. Goosey forward. Good girl. And the path is like really good here. Um, but on the other side, yeah, this one isn't as good. <laughs> this makes me feel like I'm a uh, Joy Ross. I love her videos. Another blind YouTuber. She's awesome. Good girl. So like, because she's such a young dog, it's definitely not perfect. Um, but we do our best to go through the snow. And actually powdery snow like this is a lot easier than um, icy snow. Okay, here we are at a bigger intersection with a traffic light, but the same rules apply, so I hear all clear. Goose, go! Forward! He said goose, go. Okay. Usually the streets are really clear, so if I'm ever at a spot that's super clear, I always get worried I'm in the street. Hop up, hop up, hop up, hop up, hop up. Good girl! Atta girl! Forward! No. Goose. Good girl. So as you guys just saw, she did get a little bit confused right there. Uh, because she didn't know if it went right or left and the snow is everywhere. So definitely it's a lot harder to navigate when it's snowing. And she has a lot more traction on her feet than I do. Like, she has four paws. <laughs> Atta girl. Good girl. And a crosswalk. Good sport. Good girl. Good girl. Huh? We definitely travel a lot slower for this step, for sure. 
if it wasn't for the snow, we'd probably be zooming on along. But this is our slow pace. And she's actually keeping really close to the side of the building. Um, that's because there's a lot of snow on the other side. area feels nice and flat and she's able to find the flat part and stay on it for the most part. Over there to right it. Reaction forward. We are trying to get over there. Right it did not do a good job today, did they, Goose? Shoveling. Chugging through the sludge. Atta girl. driveway up here that we go through that we go to the store good job at a girl you're even turning yourself forward you know where we're going going to right aid good girl up inside inside good girl forward Atta girl as you guys just saw she did an excellent job guiding me throughout the snow um it's now night time so i brought her to our backyard and we're gonna let her play for a bit okay go play you did such a good job sometimes i hear people say that uh they're upset that service dogs have to work all the time, but as you can plainly see, she gets plenty of playtime as well. They are definitely not recognizable after they have their harness taken off. <laughs>
Thank you.